Well, half a dozen teenagers are in camp this week. Yeah, they're making musical instruments, but it's all about the skills. Health specialist Kathy Walsh joins us now, and this is a truly one-of-a-kind experience. That's right. All of these campers are on the autism spectrum. All are learning trade skills and building toward success. 16-year-old Lily Roberts is learning to work a circular saw. Kind of loud. It is kind of loud. Other teenagers try different tools. It's actually really fun. They're in the midst of making ukuleles. I really like it because I'm really good with my hands. They've already built box drums called cajones. But it's not so much the music that matters. They're learning math, they're learning sanding, they're learning instrument safety, tool safety. This is Fuse Camp, fostering unlimited success and empowerment. For ages 12 to 16, all kids on the autism spectrum. Measuring everything, getting everything square. Putting it's it all run together. by both Danny um, Combs of TACT, teaching the autism community job. trades, and the Star Institute for Sensory Processing Disorder, which concentrates on social skills and sensations. How to cope with frustration, how to cope with um, sounds and feelings and sights that might not be comfortable for their body. It's about people with autism gaining confidence, discovering an interest. Maybe I could build something when I get home. Perhaps shaping a future. The autism community is the highest unemployed group in the country. The hope is camps like this, offering real-world skills, can strike a chord that leads to a future career. The two nonprofits, TACT and Star Institute, are able to offer Fuse Camp thanks to a grant from Developmental Pathways, which serves people with developmental disabilities and their families. Isn't it great? Three nonprofits working together. Yeah. So great. And teaching those kids those skills are incredible. Mm -hmm. It's really Something awesome. Else. Yeah, thanks, Kathy.